Hello Pelican Sound members, head golf professional Tim Harris here to talk to you a little bit more about the rules of golf and more specifically the new modernized rules of golf that are going to be taking place starting January 1st of 2019. Today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the bunker. Uh, there's a new rule in place now that if you do have a bad lie in a bunker, an unplayable lie, as you can see here, my ball is buried in the bunker. I don't feel like I can play that. So under the old rules of golf, you could take an unplayable lie in a bunker, but you had to keep the ball inside the bunker within one club length. So I could take the ball out. I could measure one club length back, no closer to the hole. And then I could drop the ball and play from there. Well, let's say you have a fear of hitting out of the bunker or you don't really want to hit out of the bunker again. You don't enjoy hitting out of the bunker. You never could take the ball completely out of the bunker, but now you can. But you have to understand that if you do that, and we'll go back to the original lie, if you do want to take the ball out of the bunker, you do so under penalty of two strokes. Keeping it in the bunker is only a one stroke penalty. But I can take the ball now, I can draw a line from the flag stick, which is in this direction, straight to where the ball kind of came to rest, and then go back on a straight line as far as I want, back here, I can drop the ball, again, under penalty of two strokes, and I can go ahead and play that ball now from where it is lying. So the thing to remember is that if you are coming out of the bunker, you do have to keep the flag stick on a line between where the ball is in the bunker and then on a straight line back. Uh, other things you, you, you should probably want to know is that you are allowed to sole your club on the, in the bunker like this as long as you're not doing it in the act of hitting the ball. You can remove loose impediments, natural impediments when you're in a bunker. You still can't ground your club when you're going to hit the ball. But if you were resting your weight on the club and your, and your club happens to touch the sand, there's no penalty there. We hope this explains some of the new rules. We also have attached a USGA video to help further explain. It has some neat graphics on there as well. And we hope uh, everyone enjoys the new rules as they come forward here in the next couple months. Thank you.